from the mandatory signs, we have come to the warning signs. The warning signs are in triangle shape and they are very, very important for every driver because they alert you of the hazards ahead. Where you are able to find animals, human beings, or whatever on the highway, you can avoid an accident when you follow the warning sign and you slow down. Let's go through them. The warning signs, we begin with the bend left. Bending left means you are approaching a bend, you got to slow down to avoid knocking others or losing control. Road narrows from the right. You can see one side is narrow, the other side it remains straight. So you have to use the available space. Slippery road. We have a car there, we got slippery marks where the road it could have rained or it, is, it has been slippery all along. You have to slow down. Wild animals crossing ahead. You are approaching a game reserve or a game park. You have to slow down at 40 kilometers per hour. Junction ahead cross rate intersection, there is a road crossing where you are passing, be careful with whoever is coming. You got to slow down, check right and left, then you continue. Minor road from right skew, you can see there is a road from a skew and normally the cyclists may join and you may knock them, so slow down to avoid accident. Road works ahead, you can see there is a gentleman over there and he's working on the road, so you have to slow down, avoid knocking them. Loose surface road. You can see there are some stones splashed by the vehicle tire. So please, in this area, slow down. Use a heavier gear to avoid skids so that you can remain on control of your vehicle. Road narrows from the left, the opposite of from the right. You can see the road one side has become so narrow, you have to use the available space. Bend right, turn to the right is almost as bend left. So there is a corner, you have to slow down and maintain your lane. Successive bend to the left, you can see there are several bends in mountainous areas like Bundibugi. So you have to slow down, you have to go slowly and maintain your lanes. River bank, you can see vehicle and an open water body. So you have to slow down and find out if there is a boat or a ferry to continue. You won't go into the water like at Lake Victoria. Danger of falling rocks ahead, you can see there is a mountain or a hill. There are rocks falling down. They will fall on you, like around Elgon Mountain or Rezori, please. When you see this, excavation is taking place, you have to slow down and watch. Traffic light signals ahead. We have the standard signals. We have red, amber, and green. So you should know there is control. Like at Ginger Road, you have to slow down before you reach this place and know when to go. Roundabout ahead. You have to determine your lane, where you are going, before reaching the roundabout. There is an intersection, slow down. Crossing with barriers, railroad crossing without barriers. So where there is a gate, they will close for you when the train is coming. Where there is no gate, there is no closing. You may get, become a risk. So what you do, please watch left and right before passing this area. We have low flying aircraft crossing ahead. This area has planes that are flying low. You have to watch, they may raise a lot of dust, noise, they may hit your vehicle. You have to be more careful. Pedestrians crossing. Please, pedestrian crossing or zebra crossing, you have to slow down and watch if there is nobody coming, then you pass. If there's somebody, wait for them to go. Everybody is a pedestrian, remember? Successive bend to the right, there is a bend that goes left and then to the right, uh, right and then right again. So please slow down, avoid hitting others. Deep, steep descent ahead, there's a steep slope, just like the steep ascent. When there's a steep hill, prepare yourself how to go down or up. And even road surface ahead, there could be a lot of humps, there could be a road which is not uniform, just like the severe hump. These ones are many, but this one is one. So you have to slow down, maybe approaching a built up area or a town. Children crossing, you can see the children too there. You have to watch in that area, you don't knock them. A cyclist in this area it has a lot of bicycles, you have to slow down. Two way traffic ahead, vehicles are driving in opposite direction, please watch them not to knock you. Uh, hazard ahead. You can see this is a general warning sign. Everybody has to slow down. Crosswinds. We have crosswinds in this area, mostly in dry areas like in Karamoja, uh, Laka Songola. You can find winds which can enter your vehicle and disrupt your driving. So you have to watch. End of dual carriageway. There are two roads, and now it's going to become one road. Just like beginning of door carriage ahead, when it was one road and they are beginning to be two roads, you have to use the available roads. Road junction ahead, there's an X shape of a junction, check where you're going and slow down. We have cattle crossing ahead, 
where animals are, you have to slow down at 50 kilometers per hour till when you pass this area. Severe deep ahead, we have a drift, a river bend, drift, or a severe deep. This one, severe deep, does not have water, but the drift has water, sometimes in the rainy season. So be careful before you pass. Your vehicle could get stuck there. They are common in Karamoja area. Uh, road narrows both sides. We have the road was wide, it has become narrow. Use the available space. We have T junction ahead. You never know what is ahead there. You could go out of the road or you could knock somebody. Slow down. Uh, we also have Y intersection ahead. The road is in a Y shape. So follow the road where you're going. Narrow bridge ahead, this is very, very dangerous. You could find another bigger vehicle on the bridge and you could get an accident. Slow down and watch. 